fighters, you know what? I always say this, we're hitting the best. This could be the pinnacle. And I said that last time, about the last world trip, this was the pinnacle. It's not. We've just reached a new high. This is now the pinnacle. It's another day and another vending machine. I'm not even joking yet, I'm probably gonna spend most of my money in vending machines. You sweat nonstop. The moment you walk out of that aircon, you are sweating. So if you're coming to Japan, always be prepared to carry change around. Even get one of the little classes, I'll show you that later. Bakari sweat. These are really popular over here in Japan. Actually, oh. So before I came over here, I thought it was just water, but it's nice. I own, I own supply drink, it actually tastes like, um, I don't know, it's a strange taste. Let, let me try it. Um, it tastes, it's got a little hint of citrus to it. Kind of like, um, like a, kind of like a Powerade taste to it. Now this is another big challenge, is actually finding things in shops. So we're looking for an audio jack, but let's, let's see if we can find one. Oh, oh no, it is. Like the plug? Yeah, audio jack. Uh, maybe I'll be back in the next video. Post for it. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, he spoke really good English. <laughs> look how clean the streets are, and there's no bins. That's one thing I really don't understand. No bins, but look how clean it all is. So another crazy thing in Japan, I'm only just starting to realise, I'm not used to it. When we stand on these in the UK, we stand on, on like both of it. Well, in Japan, you've got to stand to the left because people like this, that's like the fast track. They make way for people to walk through. So as you can see, Mike isn't used to it yet. He's blocking the way, but yeah, it's so efficient, super efficient. Yo, which one are you going for this time? I think I want to go for the uh, orange blend. Okay. I mean, I'm just 100% apparently. Right. Uh, yeah, but I don't believe that. Do you believe that? Um, I don't know, it's Japan, I've got to believe it. <laughs> Going for it. Got an orange blend by Minute Maid. Oh, it's our first bullet it's train. Aerodynamic. First bullet train. How fast did the bullet trains go? I think it was 300 miles 300 an hour. 300 miles an hour? I'm not sure how I feel about that. Oh. We just did our first bullet train and I'm not even joking, it was so fast. But right now we're in the city of Atami and we've got to get a bus to the next location which you're already going to see. It's going to be insane. Best, spot, best abandoned spot in Japan, if not, best abandoned spot in the world. We're hitting, we're hitting banger after banger. You know we're always upping up our game. It's all in like, that's what, that's what I love about Japan. Like even the music like that, it's all in like a 16 bit tone. So we're at the family mall, look at this. It's like peas and it's, it's got, what's that milk? Yes, yeah, it's milk, it's heating it up. It's milk? Peas and milk. Very, very unusual. That's it? I don't know. Well I got water and one of these jelly protein shakes. Bam. Jelly protein shakes? Yeah, the jelly, these, yeah. Look, Whoa. a special jelly drink designed to supply proteins as more as an easily absorbed. We'll just drink those every day. I'm down. All day. Well, they do them in mineral. We should buy one of each. Minerals, calcium, protein. We've got them all. I'm so down if you're down. Oh, wow. Oh, it, 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 it actually is nice. Is it? I don't know why or why they had it to like, look like peas, but it just flows and melts in your mouth. That's really, really strange. Look how strange this is. It's just so weird. You know, I got this one. Oh, yeah, magnesium. I got zinc, copper, magnesium, and calcium, and iron. Bah, bah. Look at it. Got a shuttle bus. <laughs> we actually shouldn't have it. It takes us to a resort. 
Um, but we actually, obviously, not staying there. Oh, it's, all I can hear is crickets everywhere. That right there, everyone, is the abandoned billionaire's mansion. I'm going to drop a lot more history soon. What, what, I mean, what would that be? Would that be a garage for his... I wonder if his cars are in there. Bro, it wouldn't surprise me. I bet he's got Lambos in there. Oh. I'm oh, not ready for this. <laughs> Guys, I'm really excited. It's been a long time since we've been in an abandoned place. But it's been a very long time since we've been in an abandoned place inside Japan. We're coming up to the mansion now. Already coming, you can see how overgrown it was. But yet worth over a billion dollars. Water over there. Wow. Nice statues everywhere. This is insane. I don't know. Fuck it. Maybe I don't know where I'm going anymore. You know what? We messed up. We should have wore camo like these two. <laughs> That's why we wore the camo. Is there any... <laughs> Guys, I'm dripping. We sweat. Absolutely dripping. It's so hot. It's 34 degrees here right now. And then going around the bush. It's just absolutely yeah, insane. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. This is it. <sighs> Wow. <laughs> this is something. This is for sure it. This is something. And the thing is, this is, there's two parts. So we're starting off from the top part. After we see this, we're going to go down to the bottom part. Bro. Which is bigger. So we're going to the second, top first. Our second rug with a head on it. Two. There's two. Oh my god. What? Wow. <laughs> oh, it's a tiger. And a leopard. Wow. I can't even control my breathing. Oh my. Guys, I thought that in France when we saw that bear rug, that was the last one I'd ever see. This is insane. Look at this one, it's actual, it's a tiger. Yeah. That's so messed up. This is crazy. You know, they're worth about 5,000 pounds yeah. each, just for that rug. Probably even more. Probably even more. We're going to try and spend a lot of time here, go for everything because it's massive. Now, bear in mind, this was just his bedroom. Bear in mind, this was just his bedroom. This was a bedroom. Look at the bed. Look at the platform for the bed. Fighters, you know what? I always say this. We're hitting the best. This could be the pinnacle. And I said that last time, about the last world trip, this was the pinnacle. It's not. We've just reached a new high. This is now the pinnacle. This is, has got to be the... I've been in one room and this is already the best abandoned spot I've ever been to in my life. So I'm going to drop a bit of history on this place. The guy who used to live here billionaire, absolute millions upon millions upon millions into the billions he is currently in prison he's in jail because of tax evasion so eventually caught up to him there's a reason why people stay rich and there's billionaires and that's because tax evasion so yeah he went to prison and this, all these properties have been left abandoned ever since, now this is only one property, we know of a few stay tuned for the rest of the Japan trip it's going to be the best it's insane look at that uh, yeah, I've been to, I've been to a, a, I think I've been to amazing places, and every time I do a trip, I find something better, and I, I continue to say like this is the pinnacle of, of our exploring career. Yeah. But right now, I walked into here, one room, and already I'm saying this is the pinnacle, this is the best, absolutely amazing. I mean, to have two rugs like that just led to it still. Mafia movie. Yeah. yeah Scarface. Where, like, the billionaire loses his mind and throws like a crazy party. Right, to think, to think, this is just his bedroom. What else is in this mansion? I wonder if there's any more bedrooms. Only one way to find out, guys. Let's go explore. Oh, look at this day. All I can hear is bugs everywhere, but look at this. There's so much art in here. It really looks like something out of a Scarface movie. Marble pedestals everywhere. It's weird because it's built. It's 
built like right on the edge of a cliff and you've got the sea just over there. Yo, I didn't even notice that. Look outside on the balcony, he's got a bath on the balcony. Oh, it's locked. <laughs> There's an actual bath on the balcony. It's insane. I'm, I'm guessing this is like an expensive painting. I don't know artists. I'm not massive, massively clued upon art, but I'm gonna assume with everything else going on here, they're gonna be very expensive pieces. Oh yeah, I didn't even see this room. Oh, it looks like a real dojo. No way. It's fully decked out This is insane. Wow. Look, you've got the robes and stuff they're wearing here. Look at that. They still got his and hers robes. Yeah. What's in the back here? Still it's like the stones. There's still all kinds of things back here. It's like for the tea and stuff, yeah. Yeah, you are right. It is a tea room. It looks like a martial arts dojo, though. It does, right? It's all like vases or something? Yeah. Oh, it's like. Over Right, so we're going to venture upstairs. Every every time I look at somewhere, I find something new. Oh, this, this chandelier's fallen down. Wow. I've got a feeling this is just his guest house, you know. This is? This is the guest yeah, house. I mean, they have, they have a uh, private uh, art collector's building somewhere else that's not here, that's in California. Okay. This is just one of their many spots. But this was an art collection though for him. Oh, wow. You got the Wabakiza. Look at this. Them chairs must be worth a fortune. It's just unbelievable. Yo, Josh, there's still liquor over here. Oh, no. Is that a white tiger rug? I don't know, guys. I It's not an albino tiger, but wow. I can't believe it. I just, I, I just don't. I just can't believe it. Wow, look at this, it's like a, it's a kitchen, but it looks like an industrial kitchen. What are these? What's going on? I need your help. Look at the state of this, what I found. I think it's some kind of old um, manuscript. A manuscript? Yeah, yeah. You know, they've got like this super old, like hundred, like four or five hundred years old manuscript. Now, I don't want to touch it because I don't want to damage it, but I'm pretty sure that rolls out into like a big script. So how do you want to do this? I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't want to damage it. That's one as well. But look at it all. It's all like... Oh, yeah, the paper goes all moving out. Yeah, yeah. So a manuscript, what is that? Well, it could be anything from like um, old scholars' letters to uh, old teachings. It could be anything, there's, there's numerous things it could be, um, but a lot of the history is kept on manuscripts like this, and some of them are thousands of years old, so I don't know how old this is. Um, it looks old. I don't want to yeah. open it just in case. You may as well just leave it. Do you think? I mean, I want to see what's on it, but I also don't want to damage it. I'm going to leave it. Yeah, just in case. I think that's a good, that's a good shout. Sorry, guys, I, I just don't want to damage it. I mean, this just looks insane. You know, the mountains are overlooking on that side, but then you're overlooking the sea on this side. It's just... Oh. It's, it's, it's the I mean, best spot look, we've ever done for look, a band. Look at how much Josh is sweating. Now, I've never sweated this much in my life. Times that by two, that's how much I'm sweating. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's insane. If you haven't already, consider liking the video because... I mean, I'm, I'm not even going to say consider. I mean, you have to like the video because look at this spot. Come on, guys. We, we travelled to Japan for this.
I can't believe there's even full bottles of like brandy or whiskey over here. Hennessy, full bottle of Hennessy. Insane, absolutely insane. Just look at that. Take it in guys, take it in. We ain't rushing around here. This is a place we cannot rush around. We're gonna take our time. Feast your eyes on the best abandoned spot on the planet. No, honestly, I just I don't know what else could beat it. I don't think, I mean, dude, I think just we just take one of these home, it's like 100K. I mean, I'm just saying, like, that's the value. It could be even more, I don't know. It's just crazy, though. I mean, he obviously, he, he had more money than he knew what to do with. Yeah, that's for he, sure. There's no possible w reason why this would just be left abandoned. I mean, obviously, he's gone to prison, yeah. but no one else has reclaimed it. Yeah. No family. I think, the gov I think what the government did is took some of his properties for, like, the debt he supposedly owed. Okay. But he's still in jail. Wow. And that's a maybe. I don't know if that actually happened. Yo, this statue is creepy. Look at the eyes. The eyes are watching. And I mean, I know there's going to be people on the comments, like there was from when we was in France, saying, the last place is not abandoned. I mean, believe me, trust me, it's abandoned. I will show you some bits that are smashed up, some bits that are, you know, broken down with decay. But yeah, this is 100% abandoned. Including this, prob pro <laughs> probably about half a million pounds worth of table and chairs. Absolutely insane. And one thing is for sure. We're sweating that much, we have to keep hydrated. It's just a matter of safety. So look where I have got a bottle of water. <sighs> Lifesaver. Now we've got to watch out. I'll probably sweat that water bottle out in about five minutes. I mean, I just, I wish I knew who made these. Leave a comment below if you know what style and maybe the artist of these, because these, these have got to have an artist. These are not mass produced. This is all handmade stuff. It's got to be. I'm going to probably say insane an insane amount of times because of this place. I mean, I bet you this thing is worth thousands and thousands. I have no idea, but I bet you it is. These are actually made out of stone as well. I don't, I don't even know what that is. He still is. We'll take one look from the stairs at the chandeliers and the mirrors on the ceiling. Let's head back down here. Oh, uh, I think my dad has one of these. It opens up somehow. And you can put your alcohol in there. It's empty though. Oh, so look, it's actually got some of his suits and stuff still in here. I bet these are super expensive makes. Regal. All this stuff and then you've got an old TV in the corner. Doesn't make sense though. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Really kind of strange. Wow, look at this. Massive stained glass uh, lampshade. Lead and stained glass. That's amazing. I bet that's worth a fortune. The money in here is in it's insane. And it's just left to rot. It's a cool thing. Yo, go, go watch the bars. Yo. Ha ha ha, I trolled you. you. I got you. I don't believe it though, yo. <laughs> I know, I know. That's why I said it. <laughs> I'm getting back from that French trip. <laughs> oh, what is this one? That, that's a tiger, the other one's a leopard. Josh, open the door. Come out here for a bit. 
Oh, it's nice and cool. Just look at this. They would literally just bathe here and just kick it. Yo, he was eating out to live. Yo, imagine he had this hot girlfriend, man, just here bathing at his, his fancy art gallery. Oh, man. How the other half live, eh? Yeah. How the other half live. Probably heard me complain before, but I actually appreciate coming out into this cool air now after being in there because it's a sweat box. It really is. Just I can't wait to get in the aircon again. Look at these in here. The traditional Japanese figures of some sort. Okay. I gotta say, what do you think? Leave me a comment below in the comment section. I'm I'm struggling to get to terms with this. It's like a sweat box in here. I'm literally pouring oh, sweat. First of all, this for in Japan, second day of my trip. And wow, I've got another 23 days left. Um, I don't even know what more to expect. Uh, this is the best abandoned spot I've ever been to in my life. Uh, well, most value in it. I'm not even finished yet. There's another house, literally a stone throw away, which is his property as well. We're going to go and film that. I'm not sure if it's going to be the same video. I might even take you know, two videos about this because we've got the vlog, we've got the abandoned, and now we've got another property. And he's got a garage that no one's been in yet. What the hell is going to be? You see what's in here. What kind of cars is he gonna have in the garage? So if you've been enjoying Japan so far, smash that like button. It took a lot for me to get it. Obviously, you know, petrified planes. The plane ride was so turbulent. It was shaking constantly. I couldn't sleep. I didn't sleep for two days. Last night was the first time I slept in almost three days. Um, I'm dreading going home. Absolutely dreading to fly home. You know what, I'm doing it for you guys. I told you I'd come. I, I'm a man of my word. I booked that ticket. I said to Josh, right, I'm coming. And that's me now on the plane, so. Smash that like button for that. So we think we just found the first big spider in Japan. I think that is a spider. Oh my, that looks hor that looks hor horrifying. <laughs> Bro, that, that is a spider, definitely. I ain't touching that. Josh, just poke it. Poke it oh, once. Yeah. It looks like a camel spider also. Oh, I don't... Watch, it does look... I think it might be... Oh! 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 Where'd it go? It's just dropped down. Shut the fuck out. It's just dropped down there. I think it might be dead. Maybe an already dead one. Oh my god, that scared me. <laughs> it scared me! <laughs> <laughs> so I just want to say, me and Josh are actually the first ones here. We just give uh, our friend Steve um, a, a link. So maybe he might come here. Maybe he'll put out the video before us. I don't, I'm not sure, but you just know we were here first. Definitely Steve. first. Steve. <laughs> Dude, Steve, you gotta come here, bro. Steve, Steve, honestly, this is your kind of spot. I mean, I just, I hope one day you get to see something like this. Yeah. Steve Ronan. What's in here? What's that noise? I don't want to know right now, actually. Wait. Shh. No, where's that noise coming from? Somewhere way outside. You sure? It's catchy. Where the hell's that noise coming from? Coming from all the... I know what that is. I think I know what that is. It's music that plays at every like... Certain time? Certain time in the day. And everyone stops working to do an exercise. Really? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what it is. So uh, maybe outside of Tokyo. That's Leave me a comment thing. below because I know they do like this. They're proper into the fitness and keeping well-being and all that kind of stuff. And I'm sure halfway through the day, whatever, they play a song and everyone starts doing some exercises. Oh, uh, nothing here. Oh, but do you know what? Do you know what this is? Huh? Do you know what this is? What? Kurua pendas. It means this is a pen. You already know I've been looking at that Japanese. I've been trying to learn Japanese. Kuro pendas. I'm gonna get it on film. What, what do you think of this? Because I thought it was just too, it was way too strange to drink. Okay, ready? This is the mineral version. Mineral version has some iron, calcium, zinc, copper, and magnesium. I'm not sure if that's gonna help me anything, in anything here, but we're gonna try it anyway. Mm. Mm -hmm. What color is yours? Purple. Oh. I taste a strong grape, and there's like jelly in it. Oh, should I got that one? But see, mine was a bit more weird cause, because mine was like a milky white. Mm. I think because it was milky white, I felt a bit strange drinking it. I mean, I still have the jelly all in it though. Yeah, yeah. 
Yo, uh, I can't believe Mike's just picked picked this. Bro, oh, bro, what are you doing? Oh, don't bring it near me, honestly. Seriously. <laughs> don't, don't you, honestly, bro, Listen. don't. Don't do it. You know snakes? Right? We know what snakes are. We know snakes shed their skin. Spiders also shed their skin. This is not actually a real spider. It's a spider's skin. That's it's insane. like being scared of a t-shirt, man. Are you scared of t-shirts? If they look like that, yeah, of course <laughs> I am. So it's not a real spider. Is it still dark? Look, it's still got... Yeah. That's insane. I mean, I, I I'm so petrified. Still alive. I'm petrified to see what came out of that though. No, it, there's a spider that's bigger than that now. Because they, no. shit, they shit their skin when they grow. So that's his old skin. He's now bigger than that somewhere in here. That's my kid to leave. Yeah, I'm playing home early. I mean, how much, how much is a bottle of Hennessy these days? That's insane, Hennessy just sat there. When you know, this is when you know, you're not in the UK or anywhere anymore when there's a big copper tank just sat there outside and all that lead on, on the roofs. It's just... We're in Japan, people. That's how we do it in Japan all day, every day. Well 2016, bro! There's papers, newspapers in here from 2016. I have no clue. It could be set up for pictures. Do you think? Like, you know what I mean? I don't know, bro. Oh, I forgot to read back to front. Well, that's 2014. Yo, what's going down? I heard you've made some discoveries. Check out these masks. Wow. They're so cool. Do you want to get the, the third one? We gotta take some sick Actually, those masks, yeah, yeah, they look freaky a bit. Yeah, they are. They're nice though. Bam. I would good, good find. <laughs> yeah, good find. Look at the layers of cobwebs on, on here. It's not raining so long. There's cobwebs all over. Look at the size that. I don't know if it's a moth or a butterfly. It's massive though. Here's a butterfly. All these insects, it's so loud, it's hurting my ears. It seems like they're all hanging around the pylons. It's so loud. All in front of us. Yo. This is it. Pray for us, guys. Going in, Japanese spiders everywhere. They are not nice small things either, they are massive. I feel like they're gonna eat part of me. This is amazing. Oh wow. No way, this isn't. Yeah, this is your house, guys. No. I'm walking on top of this area, though. Ah, <gasps> the door's open. Quick, let's go. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Let's go. Dude, the tiger. The tiger. <laughs> no. I was looking for the tiger. What? What is that? It's a peacock. Dan, you okay, bro? No, no, I need to sit down, bro. This is. This, I need to wake up. Seeing three other different carpets. Welcome to go online right now. Find out how much a taxidermy tiger is. I'm gonna guess eighty thousand pound. So many packages of brand new stuff. It looks like brand new antiques that have been shipped over. Um, Josh. You're gonna wanna come down here. Do you need gems? Bro, we could have just made history right now. I think so. Bro, there's hundreds of them in bo in these boxes. There's hundreds, there's millions of pounds worth of just antiques all over. This is the best thing ever. This is the best find ever. That's ever. I was about to say, I was about to say that's teeth, that's, no. No. I, I, can't swear, I swear. I can't take any more. No, I can't. I can't do it. No. No. <laughs> no. I don't know. I don't know, but it's just amazing to look at. This, this is actually 
what is wrong in this world. You've got all this millions and millions of pounds worth, but then look at the roof. You've got damp, then look at here. You've got I give it five years, it's all ruined. Five years, yeah. all gone. Yeah, it's ruining the wood art too. Yeah, that's what I mean. It's, it's a, such a shame. No! That looks, that looks um, mine almost. Okay. I'm gonna say that's probably worth a good <laughs> I don't know, million. You're gonna find out what that is, but look at that in there. That's the jackpot. Oh, bro, that is jackpot. Yeah, I can see his eyes glistening. <laughs> oh!